Hey everybody, it is great to have you with us here on the WB Mason Post Game. Bob Lorenz and Jack Curry with you. Final game of this four game series, and the Rays win it four to two. And Jack, this feels like one of those games the Yankees will lament on the flight home, wasting opportunities and then creating too many opportunities for the Rays. Yankees have had a superb season so far, Bob, but this will be remembered, as you said, as one of their most frustrating losses of the season for several reasons. And let's start with the fact that they're playing their fierce rival in the American League East, and they have a chance chance to take three out of four in this series. You want to go out there and you want to control the narrative. That's what we talked about on the pregame show. Severino was terrific, but he is going to lament that 3-1 fastball to Walls, a guy who was one for 34 before he took that pitch out of the ballpark to give the Rays the lead. Missed opportunities galore for the Yankees against McClanahan. We said on the pregame, you get opportunities against him, you have to cash in. They didn't do that. And then the gift-wrapped opportunities that you talked about. The decision to go to Marinaccio we had thought on the pregame that Schmidt would be a late inning option. Well, Marinaccio walks one guy with the bases loaded, hits another with the bases loaded, so that when Judge gives them a little of injection of offense late, it makes it a 4-2 game instead of potentially a 2-2 game. So, so much to cover in this game for the Yankees. And though they did end up with a series split, that leaves a bad taste in your mouth when you've won the first two of the four-game series. Yeah, Yankees going 0-9 for 9 with runners in scoring position. They left 7 on base.